Conrenoise or flowing techniques. So uh, in Conren Conrenoise, flowing techniques is not a direct translation of Conrenoise, but Conrenoise are, are techniques that when, when one doesn't work out, how to change into another technique. A lot of times when people are studying Aikido, they see the important techniques as something from the Kyowaza, right? So Ikkyo, Nikkyo, Sankyo, Yonkyo, those techniques. Or something from the Nage Waza, you know, Kokyu Nage, Irimi Nage, Juji Nage, Shio Nage, one of those kind of techniques. That's what they think of as being important techniques in Aikido. But there's a lot of other techniques we do that we really don't talk about much, right? So the escaping techniques, the Hidoki Waza, this is also an important series of techniques. So if Mike's grabbing me here, how do I get out of this? How do I keep Mike from grabbing me? One of the very commonly prescribed methods is a triangle step, or what we call a triangle step, which is this position. And when I do that, I strike Mike in the face. Now you can see, while I'm doing this technique, that I'm pulling my shoulder away and keeping Mike away from me, and that enables me to pop free here. Nice triangle step to pop free. Another technique that we see and we often don't talk about is a sopo mawari, so turning to the outside. And with this, I'm going to put my arm here on Mike's arm, and I'm going to turn my wrist in. This makes a yakugokyo, a wrist reversal here. And I turn out and, and pop free. So we're here. Here's a sopo mawari. And another technique we often see in Aikido is uchi mawari. And that's a technique done to the inside, so I'm coming inside. Now, it's important to understand that techniques do not have a 100% success rate. If any one technique had a 100% success rate, we would just do that technique. It would be the greatest system in the world. No one could ever defeat us. And I think it would be the best. And everyone would say it's great. And we know that's not true. So you have to understand that techniques have failure points. If we flow these techniques together, we eliminate the chance that we're going to have zero success. And so what I mean by that is, let's say I go to my triangle step here, and Mike's real strong and tough. I hit him in the face, I pull back as hard as I can, and I have no success here, right? So I can't get out here. What can I flow into from here? Well, as Mike tries to come into me, I can turn outside and get a sulfamore. So here I cleared his arm by using sulfamore. Now, Mike can thwart my sulfamore by rolling his wrist out as he makes oh, his arm kind of strong here, so I can't get to the outside very easily. But that enables me to shoot through, and we get uchimore here. So as I find one technique that doesn't work, let's say triangle step, I can work another technique, sotomori. Now that might not work. And if Mike comes around, maybe I can go uchimori. That didn't quite clear. Then I can use triangle step. The techniques fit inside of each other really, really nicely. So if you practice flow drills like this, you'll start to get the idea of how you need to be moving. So instead of just performing a technique, you know, if you just do the forms, then this always clears for you. Or it's always just a setup for ikkyo, right? Something like that. But that's not the case. Of course, there are a lot more escape techniques than I showed right now. I can probably think of six more off the top of my head really, really quickly. And you should look in the forms and see what those are, and then practice them. Loop them together so you get a flowing drill. Find a way to work these. This is a nice live practice for people to start to work with, where Mike just tries to hold it. I try to escape. And I go until I find my escape. So I'm not really trying to do those techniques. I'm trying to escape. The techniques will naturally start to link together, and I will find a way to achieve my goal. Right? My goal is just to get free in that situation. I'm Chris Hine. This is Michael Barron. Thank you for watching.